Hi, welcome to the video tutorial on how to add the panoramic camera to both the NVR and also to the Smart PSS software and how to do warp on both of them. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to show you how to add the IP camera to the NVR. First, make sure that the IP camera is assigned an IP address that's in the same network segment as the NVR. Make sure they're both connected to the same switch. Once you confirm that, then in the NVR, right-click on your mouse to go into the main menu. In the main menu, you want to select the camera icon here. You want to click Device Search and wait until the camera IP address shows up. Check the box and then as you can see here, wait until the IP address shows up. Make sure that the status shows green. Once that shows green, then the camera should already be visible. Click Apply, click OK. To be able to see the camera in the different view modes, you want to right click on your mouse and you want to click the split track option. There's three view modes as you can see here. The first one is the default panoramic view mode. The second option shows the default view mode in the upper left hand corner here with three different color squares which shows the three different images here. When you click and drag the different color views, you can see that they move, so you can have a different perspective of each camera view in the same scene. Or you can just click the view itself, and as you can see, the squares move. The next thing we're going to do is show you how to add it to the Smart PSS software. Again, the Smart PSS software is installed on a computer that should be in the same network as the camera. So make sure that your IP camera is in the same network segment as your computer, connected to the same switch or the router. First thing you want to do is go to the home page, go to device icon, and then click search until you see the IP address of your camera show up here. Once it shows up and the status shows green online, then you're ready to view the camera. You want to click Live View, and again, right click on the mouse, and there's an option that's called Multi-Screen Track. As you can see, there's three view modes, just like in the NVR. There's Normal, 1 plus 3, and 1 plus 5. If you click Normal, it shows the regular panoramic view mode. If you click the 1 plus 3 mode, as you can see, in the upper left hand corner here, the first view mode has three different color channels, which indicate these three views here. Just like in the NVR, when you click and drag the color squares, the individual scenes move. Now we're selecting the 1 plus 5 mode, and you can see there's five different color rectangles. So one thing you want to keep in mind is this, unlike the fisheye camera, you can only add one channel to do the dewarping on both the Smart PSS and on the NVR. The panoramic camera, you have to have it in full screen mode in order to see the options. Once again, thank you for watching.